Greetings, my name is Jay, and welcome to my The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild Let's Play. This is episode 3. Uh, we just completed a quest for an old man who won't really give us any information in the last episode, and has told us that we need to complete three more quests. Uh, so the logical thing to do is obviously distraction, uh, and we're going to go back to the two chests we saw in the last episode, episode 2, and see if those chests are magnetic, because the chests must be found and opened. Uh, so we're going to do that, and uh, we're going to go to the closest dungeon, uh, which was, I believe, south of us. Um, and yeah, so that's what we're going to be doing in this episode. Uh, maybe we do the other dungeon too. It really depends on if we run out of time or not. Okay, so I want to know if... I climbed down the last time, and I'm thinking I did that like a derp, so I'm going to actually... Okay, I didn't die. And I didn't take damage, so that's good. I almost looped off, though. Oh, but it's good to know that you can actually do that. You can climb down, too, as we found out in the last episode. That's how I did it. <coughs> you know, they think they would make getting up and down one of these towers a lot easier, but I digress. Don't ask questions. Uh, okay, so going to the minimap, the select key, we're going to go up here. So can I... It's the green one? Yep, yeah, okay. Where we were before, because that bog has chest. Oh, and another thing I realized. Um, there's weather in the game, and a time. So it actually is time-based, not... Uh, not uh, event based as I was wondering at least I'm assuming that's how it works and I'm wondering if Link's going to get tired I really hope not um, vocal bins do they have treasure? they probably do well they're in for a rude awakening let's try and get a headshot on this guy oh he's alarmed bam right in your back boom in the face Got him. I'm gonna take his stuff. Take his stuff. I only have limited inventory. Alright, let's see what they are protecting. What they're looking at. Arrows? Hmm. Those are the arrows that I fired. That was basically pointless, because I don't think there's experience points in this game. Which is getting better items. Which is really cool game design. I always liked that about Zelda. Um, how basically your equipment is what made your power level. Uh, you can beat the original one with your hearts. I've almost done it, actually. Uh, I made it up to Ganon. I have, there's a Let's Play about it if you want to watch it. It's kind of cool. What I did manage to accomplish is a pretty good feat. So uh, Let's see. No, they're not highlighting, so... Hmm. Probably need hookshot for that. Okay. Oh, uh, unless I need to be closer. Oh, okay. Nope. Didn't mean to do that. Let's run. What was I talking about? Right. Three heart quest. Or three heart challenge. Uh, yeah. Uh, check it out. It's pretty cool. Um, my battery actually died on my, uh, NES cart. Uh, which is unfortunate. And, uh, I never completed it. Uh, but I did make it to Ganon. Um, so that's cool. Not very many people can say they've done that. Uh, alright, so... Can we... No, we... Oh, wait a sec. Uh, okay, so I need something to glide over there or something. Yeah. Well, it's worth a shot, but we are going to get rid of that icon because it's going to confuse the hell out of me. Oh, that's the capture button. Uh, this button, right? And... Why... Whoops. Okay. Uh, edit pins is the minus sign. So we want to select this pin, delete it. Oh, the pin disappears when we get to it. So really what we want to do is go to this Eastern Abbey place. Temple of Time. I thought it was Japanese underneath it for a second, but it's a Hylian text. <laughs> Uh, and these other places over here. Okay, um, anyway, let's get out of here. 
and go towards that pin. All right. Um, it is the fellow pin. Got to make sure that I get those right. Because I don't want to walk all the way over to another pin. Because I'm assuming the difficulty level is probably going to jump up a little bit. Because I'm going to get an item from each of them. So, Alright. Let's try and get our way over to this dungeon. But yeah, I've always liked the level design in Zelda. They're pretty cool. Uh, you can do any of the... I'm referring to the first Zelda. I guess to an extent, the early ones too. You can do them in any order. Um, guessing you can probably do that with this too. It'll probably become obvious as we... Is that a frog? Oh, that's pretty cool. Is it food? Can I eat them? Nope. I might have squished them though. That's too bad. I like frogs. Um, you can do them in any order and stuff, and, uh, I always find that fun. Uh, kind of later on in the franchise, they're very, very linear, so I'm hoping that these can be done in a certain order, or any order, I mean, and not have to be done in a certain order. I would say, I mentioned the grass briefly in another episode. The grass in this game is beautiful. It's... Like, it must take a lot to render all these blades. Um, and that might seem, like, pretty stupid, but... I don't know, I grew up in an era where you basically had polygons with texture, flat textures for grass. And this is this is pretty cool. And I've seen this in other video games, like Skyrim and other games. i played tons of them, but it's still... In this game, it's very well spread out and uh, well done. Okay, uh, there's another one of those world destroyer things and the entrance to our cave, so let's go on an adventure. Um, okay. Glad these things are dead. Uh, jump over this way. Search. An ancient shaft. Okay. You use all these pieces to build something. Oh, look, there's another one. Oh, and it's alive. Um, and it doesn't look friendly. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, no. Um, hmm. Can I climb up here? Oh, it can see me up here. Well, that's not nice. Can I barrel roll? Maybe I can... It's got a laser. It's probably going to be super powerful. There's got to be a way around him. Okay, so he's in here. Oh, he hasn't noticed me yet. Uh, no, 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 no. Where's the entrance to this cave? Over here somewhere, I guess. Run, Link, run. Okay. Up. Heep. Hop. Hop. That's the entrance. I'm on the wrong side. Oh boy. Can I climb this? Please say I can climb this. Oh, you can. Nice. Ah, tricked you. The. Destroy of Worlds has failed. And I'm assuming you need bombs to take, kill this out, but none of the moblins, or I guess they're called Boko Bins in this game, um, have any bombs. So, or at least they haven't dropped them. So, okay, whatever, let's do this. Our second dungeon, I guess? Oh, well, that was a cool way to open a door. I want my door to open like that. Can't move. Oh, there we go. We've got uh, chic symbol um, on everything, basically. So uh, I wonder if that's going to be a thing in this one. Chica slate, chic Zelda. I see what you do, Nintendo. Okay. Um, gonna maybe need bombs. I will 
Bomb trial. Uh, okay. Do I need bombs before I come here? Oh wait, the last one gave me ability if I talk to this thing, so... Bombs, please? Authenticating, distilling rune... Remote bombs. Wait, remote? Ha! <laughs> awesome! A bomb that can detonate remotely. Force of the blast can be used to damage monsters or destroy objects. There are both round or cube-like bombs, whichever you prefer for the best situation. Oh, that's really cool. Huh. wonder if there's, like, bomb bombs. So that is up on the directional pad. Okay. So, left, uh, oh, right, I see. All right, what's this thing over here? Why did it chime? Oh, that's kind of reminding me of Link's Awakening. Is there a key in here? Oh, look, there's a way up here. Can I jump up here? No. Oh, must just be the music. Okay. That really... Okay, so there's a Game Boy game. Uh, if you're a big, really big Zelda fan, you probably already know this. And... Uh, how do I use the bomb? Throw. Up. Oh. Take. Um, anyway, what was I saying? And you go into the rooms and it makes that sound effect. Uh, and it tells you that there's like a secret in it or something. It's been a while since I played that game, but that's, that's pretty cool. Um, oh, okay, it's the L1 button, so let's drop this, and detonate is L. Boom! Assuming bombs hurt you in this one, because they started doing that after the first one, so... Alright, here, and drop them. Boom! <gasps> Chest! Yes! Okay, so bombs are just on a timer, so I must have unlimited. Okay, that's kind of neat. Open. A Traveler's Claymore, plus five attack. Two-handed weapon. Okay, so I can't use a shield with it. Which makes sense, because it's a Claymore, and Claymore is a two-handed weapon. Okay, oh, uh, that's pretty cool. So if we need to do more damage, that's what we'll do. So how do we throw? Throw, and then let it roll, and explode. Yes! It's very satisfying. It. I kind of get the feeling that I can maybe manipulate those things? No, I guess not. Okay. Alright, let's turn it off. And, uh... Okay. So let's go to the bomb. And throw it. Boom. Nice. Oh. Didn't mean to do that. All right, where are we going now? Um, that looks like a puzzle. Oh, there's a bomb going back. And forth. Oh, so that means I can use this as a, as a cannon or something. Hey, look, there's a chest. Is it magnetic? Probably is. Oh, wait a sec. Huh. We'd probably just go on here. Fly. Whoa, that's crazy. Amber, fossilized resin with caramelesque sheen to it. So it's amber, okay. Maybe it's used as an, as an, an ingredient. Oh, can't jump that way, all right. What is that thing? It kind of looks like a bomb. Let's uh, make sure we switch this to our bomb. 
Oh no! Did I mess that up? Oh, it's over here. So what is it? Pick up. I'm not really sure what this does, but it's mine now. Uh, can I throw it up here? Nope. This has got to be a key to something. Oh, maybe I put it on the other side. Who knows? Um, it's got to be useful for something. Oh, look at this. I'll bet you bombs go in here, because they're smaller. So if I drop, whoops, if I drop this, pick it up, drop it. Aha! Boom. Oh, okay. So what I want to do, I want to bring this with me. You probably don't even need this. Uh, can I throw it over there? Oops, wrong button. I'll pick up. And toss. Cool. So that's going to make that go over there. Okay. I must need that for something. They wouldn't put it in here if you didn't need it for anything. Oh, but there was that area up there. Maybe it's a secret. Because that's the end, dude. Alright, pick up. Maybe he wants his ball back? I don't know. Or she? Well, they all look the same. Uh, let's explore a little bit first. No, it doesn't look like anything is over here. Okay, well... Oh. Jump up here. Examine. We've unlocked this guy. Your resourcefulness is overcoming the... Uh, in overcoming this travel, trial... Trial speaks of you to being the true hero in the name of the goddess hylia i bestow upon you this spirit orb which one are you gonna give me this time i guess they're all just spirit orbs hmm maybe there's nothing to that other ball then okay so we have two of four that's pretty cool and they are going off into the heavens as well. Bye-bye. Oh, is it going to load me out? I wanted to be... I wanted to figure out what was with the, with the magic ball. Gotta mean something. I didn't see another way to get up to that other area, though. So maybe I need other items. Uh... Can we ignore it for now? Okay, so let's blow this up, because we can. Boom! Nice! Um, Watch out for laser eyes over here. Oh, is that him? Nope, but... Oh, it's him in the middle. Yeah, there he is. Run! Let go. Okay, let's just get out of here. And, uh... Okay, this should be a good place. That's the dude. And, uh, let's look at our little mini-map here. So our next one that we want to go to is way down here. That's quite a distance away, actually. And we got one over here. So River of the Dead. Oh, unless I... Mount Hylia. We're at the Temple of Time. So, I think I'm going to end this video here. What I'm going to do is, we never really explored the Temple of Time. So, I'm going to go over this way, explore the Temple of Time, and then work our way down to our pin. Um, so, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe. And uh, we'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.